Welcome, you with FPC News. 25,000 wage earners won't be eligible for tax allowances come January. Workers won't be able to claim refunds for child dependency, elderly dependents and marital allowance. Dev Narayan has more. The change only applies to people earning $20,000 and above. The decision was announced during a workshop for the Super Retailers Association today. The overall reduction in the tax rates in the 2012 budget uh, has positioned Fiji as one of the attractive players uh, for, the, for the business community as well as for the salary and wage earners uh, in Fiji. Uh, and, they are, and therefore we feel the introduction of the PAY as a final tax is, uh, is going to simplify matters for the taxpayers. Those earning below 20,000 will only qualify for child allowances. From next year, there will be major changes to how tax returns are filed. It's said to be simpler and less time-consuming. Employees will have to deduct all necessary taxes at point of source. We do acknowledge the fact that this new tax decree is going to encourage uh, some degree of voluntary compliance, uh, is going to position uh, us as tax authority uh, to use modern, modern techniques uh, to improve tax collection. Uh, as, as you know, uh, we will have some, uh, some compliance provisions inbuilt in the new decree, uh, as well as uh, for the business community there will be self-assessment uh, regime. 65,000 taxpayers each year lodge returns with FIRCA. Dev Narayan, FBC News. Nightclubs will now have to set up special areas for non-smokers. Come January 1st, this will be a must for all night spots in Fiji. Eleanor Turangai View has more. Cigarettes, even secondhand smoke, causes cancer. Call it a habit, addiction, or just part of the social scene. Smoking, just like drinking, dance and music, goes hand in hand with nightclubs. We take into consideration the, the issue of passive smoking, whereby most people that are non-smokers you know, have been exposed to secondhand smoking, which is uh, something that can also affect their health as well. The health ministry has banned smoking in taxis and buses, amusement centres and hospitals. Nightclub owners have five months to comply. Mentioned at the beginning of next year, then uh, we will have to come in and enforce, because uh, you know on one hand it's basically them running the business, but on the other hand we are considering the health of our people. Some nightclubs are already smoke-free zones or have special no-smoking areas. More are likely to follow suit. Eleanor Turangai View, FBC News. An Akasi family is calling for more police presence in their area after a break-in yesterday morning. The lone thief broke into the Prasad's home in Kavula Place at about 1 a.m. and stole cash, jewelry and other valuables valued at about $11,000. He removed window blades in the bathroom to get in. Nilesh Prasad says he was woken by noises in his bedroom and chased the man out. He came here, he opened all the drawers, and uh, our family members were sleeping here, and he took out everything from here. And, and he put uh, his leg here, and he jumped away. When the time he jumped away, I just held his leg, but I couldn't stop. But that fella, uh, almost uh, three quarters, he went outside. Police are investigating.